Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video and today I will show you guys 10 great iOS 16 home screen widget apps. Now with the release of iOS 16 and the new lock screen widgets and of course iOS 16.1 and the new live activities on the lock screen, it seems like everyone has forgotten about home screen widgets. So in this video I will show you guys 10 apps that you must try that offer great widgets for the home screen of your device. Now before we get started with the first one, just want to ask you guys for a favor, if you're watching this video and you're currently not subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing, it really helps the channel a lot. And we're starting things off with Widget Web. This app will allow it to have websites as home screen widgets. You can have multiple of those, of course, with different websites being displayed on each of them. And right here, it will show you the time since it has updated for the last time and of course the URL as well. Tapping on one of them, it will go into the app and actually open that website. Now this is how you set it up. When you go into the app, you just add a URL right there, tap the crop here, and from here you can choose which part of the website you want to see on the preview on the home screen. And just like that, you have now that website being displayed on your home screen. Now, if you 3D touch on one of the widgets here, you will be able to actually change the website which you're showing there. And if you go to the update interval, you can choose here, never or every 24 hours. Or if you have paid the pro version, you will be able to actually update it way more frequently. Next up is Live Weather. Now this is a new app that offers live activities for the lock screen and home screen widgets as well. Now I really like the design of these widgets. They look really great on the home screen. Like here we have three different ones. Of course, we have a medium one that shows the current weather of the city that you choose on the app. And then you have the hourly forecast for the next six hours. And then you will have this one. Again, it shows the current weather and then right there the weather for the next five days. And of course, we have a smaller one as well. Now, if you tap and hold on one of the widgets, you will be able to edit it and just go ahead and pick any location you want directly from there. Next is CPU Max, one of my favorite apps recently. Now this also offers lock screen widgets, but home screen widgets as well. And you can see here we have different widgets from this app. It actually offers quite a lot of widgets. We have one there for the current date, time and battery as well. Then we have there the day, the month and the year progress. That's really cool as well. We have one for health here, all the stats for your health. And then we have this one for your network so basically the uploads and downloads from your wi-fi network now let's just head on to the widgets panel let me show you guys all the different widgets you can have from this app now here we have cpu max so we have traffic statics so of course we have here the bigger ones you can see all these different ones that you can add from this one app to your home screen. So you will have smaller and medium sizes of all kinds of different widgets, more than 10 different widgets that you can add from this one app. Next up is photo widget. Now, of course, there are a ton of different photo widgets for the home screen of your iPhone, a ton of apps, and I have shown previously other apps, but this one is my favorite by far because it allows you to actually update the photo every 10 seconds now you can notice here as i'm talking the photos are being changed and it's very easy to use all you have to do is just head on into the app tap here to just add any picture you want from your photos library going right there to the settings you will be able to set the photo refresh interval now of course you can choose here from 10 seconds up to one day that's really great having this option to switch between photos that fast is really amazing i haven't seen this on any other app that's similar to this this one again is by far my favorite next is to do list now this is a very simple to do list app that shows you on your home screen the things that you have to do for the day it's very easy to use again a very simple nice interface and you can see right here you can have all kinds of different sizes of widgets but with them of course displaying the next next tasks that you have now if you have different lists on the app you can just tap on edit widget and choose right here which list you want to have there i have only one so that's what i'm having there you can also set transparent background for these if you have paid of course the paid subscription now this is the app right here you can create your lists course when you go to one of your lists you can edit it and even of course add or remove different items it also offers live activities and it has the feature where it can display also your to-do list on the dynamic island 
Next up is Countdown. Now, this is an app that offers countdowns right on your home screen. Now, the design of these widgets is really amazing. I really love what they've done with this app. They offer a lot of different widgets. So here we have different countdowns. Of course, you can add them to your home screen once you have added a widget. You can simply tap on Edit Widget and choose which event that you have there you want to show. Or you can choose the first one while they're upcoming. So it will always display the most like event that is closest to the being like current so you can go ahead and do that as well if you go into the app this is where you can of course go ahead and add all the different events that you want now let's just head on to the widgets panel let me show you guys the other widgets you can get from this app so here we have the single countdown and you will have multi countdown you will have countdown dash dashboard so it will basically show you your most recent right here and then all the other ones there and you will have the bigger one with a list of your countdowns and this one right here is a lot Live countdown for your home screen but unfortunately this is only for the paid members so if you pay the pro version you can have a live countdown on your home screen now of course whenever i do a video on widgets widget is always there of course a lot of people might say why the same app because they are never the same widgets widget is an app is a community where you have a ton of different new widgets every day so here are a few of those that are newer like this ipod right there displaying of course the music that you're playing that one right there you can see that small widget and how many information it has this one right here looks really cool so you will have basically your iphone there then the clock date and the steps you have taken and then we have a smaller one right there with all kinds of different details now these you can find of course simply by going to widget simply go to explore and at the top you will see always of course the newest ones you will have some featured here then you have newest ones that you can find of course a few of them that you just seen right there on my home screen so then we have that one that one and that one so widget always being updated always having probably the best widgets that you can get for your iphone the next app is called two stories now two stories allows you to have widgets on the home screen of your device that will display the followers of an instagram account that you choose now right here what you will see is the image and of course the username then the followers right there and within a week it will show you how many new followers that account has gained now all you have to do is just add the widget you can add the smaller one or the medium one and then simply 3d touch on it tap on edit widget and simply enter the username right there without the ad and you're good to go you will have that account being displayed on your home screen next is historico this app will show you events that have happened of course in the past but on the same day as today so november 10th you can see all the years right there and what historical events have happened this is really really awesome if you just want to know these things you're interested of course in history you can have this app and you can have different widgets of course the medium bigger and the smaller one always displaying different facts different events that have happened in the past on the same date as today and last but not least of course is tally tally is a telecounter app that offers home screen widgets and it displays your tallies right on your home screen now, you can have a smaller one with only one tally or you can have four right there on the smaller one and the medium one as well with four of them of course now you can just go ahead and tap on that it won't do anything basically it just takes you into the app and to your tallies from where of course you can edit them just like that you can go ahead and have quick access to your tally counts so that is it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video and the widgets that you saw on this video if you did please make sure to subscribe and leave a like on the video i'll see you on the next one